hello everyone so today we are going to learn how to find IC50 values using this graph pad prism okay so for this open the graph pad prism first and you will get this checkbox select XY then here you enter three replicas and then you click on create okay so this will create your graph new graph so here what we do we'll take this data from our excel sheet that is this is the concentration of drug a that is used and this is the percentage cell inhibition okay so this is the cell inhibition these are the three replicas of the percentage cell inhibition okay so in order to find the ic50 values what you need to do is that you have to transform this data first okay so to transform this data what you do you go on this analyze this data icon okay click on it now here you can see there is a transform normalized okay here you can find under it that there is a transform okay so click on the transform and click on ok so another function list will come out click on this transform x values using x equals to log x click on this and then press ok this will transform your data like this okay now the second thing what you do is analyze this transform data once again okay so you press on this analyze now here you need to go to this non-linear regression curve fit okay click on this and then press ok so this will give you another parameters so you have to select which one you want so here I want to find the dose response and inhibition okay so I'll click on it then I'll click on the log inhibitor versus response because this is the transform data this is the log x okay so I'll click on this log inhibitor versus response now press ok so this will give you the data of the non-linear curve okay so here you can find that in the sixth row there is the IC50 value so here the IC50 is 208.6 mg per ml the concentration was in mg per ml so the IC50 here automatically so you don't have to do this long work which we were doing in this excel sheet so in the graph pad prism it reduces your work it will automatically give you the IC50 values so here the IC50 value is 208.6 okay so if you don't have this graph pad prism software you can also do it using excel sheet okay so um, the tutorial video using excel is given in the link below you can go and watch it if you have the excel and you don't have the graph pad prism and if you have the graph pad prism you can use this one to find the ice 50 values right so this is how you find the ice 50 value using graph pad prism hope you have understood this video if you have any queries feel free to comment below if you want any other topic to be simplified or any other practical queries you have you can also comment that below and i'll see you in our next video